Hello everybody, this is Keith with the Georgetown County School District and today I'm going to show you sort of a little workaround, a little trick to making uh, your book creator, because we've been working with book creator in some schools, making the text for maybe your title page, how to curve that or even put it into a circle. So the first thing you're going to do is let me go here into my book creator and this is the, this is the site that you're going to go to. And let me see if I can make that a little bit bigger for you so you can see it. And this is, hold on, excuse me. And you're just going to make it a little bit bigger at all. Whoop. Okay, so it's troygram.com slash curve dash text. That's the site you're going to go to. And so when I go to that site, I'm going to go there. And I'm going to type in here where it says, I'm just going to type in, I've already got it in here just for the sake of time, my book about me. As I wanted, if I wanted to show you how that it's going to go in, I'm going to me. And I'm going to make the spacing right and all that kind of stuff. So I've got my book about me. And over here, I can change my font size a little bit. I can arch size a little bit bigger more compact i can squeeze and stretch it if i want to i'm going to do the letter spacing i can make it bigger if i had a lot of letters it would be a cool little circle there but then i'm just going to leave it right about there i can move it up or down on my screen by doing that i can move it left or right on my screen and i'm going to just center this one and so what i'm going to do now is in my chromebook I'm going to right click and I'm going to save the image as now it's not going to allow you to see what you name it other than it's going to name it for you. So it named it download three PNG. So I want to show that in my folder and I'm going to click show that in my folder and hopefully this will pop up real quick and it will be in my Google drive. Come on, slow Chromebook. And then I'm just going to sort of scroll down until I can found it. There it is right there. Download. That's the latest one that came in. Just here's the time. And I think I'm going to right click if it will let me and rename this. It's my book curve. And then I'm going to hit enter. All right, so now I've got my book curve in there saved as an image. Now I'm going to go out of my drive and I'm going to go over to my book creator. Now I'm in my book creator page and I am going to insert or import from book creator, I'm for, actually from my drive, from my drive. And it may pop up as a recent, but more than likely it's not going to here. And so I know what I just named it. So I'm going to, I'm going to type my name here, or let's see if I name it my book, my book curve. There it is. I'm going to double click that and it's going to insert that into my book creator. And I can move it around a little bit and get it on my screen and when i'm ready to see that in my book that's the way it will pop in and look on my page oops went too far go back there it is right there hope this has helped it's been a lot of fun